Vinodji, then I want to bring in Riju Datta and Mr. Sanjay Jha again. Quick response, Vinodji. Vinodji. Yes, yes. Actually, Beaufort case is a very classic case. I, I was covering Vishnu Pradhaf Singh in every meeting during 1999. He had a lot of money. He had a lot of money. He had a lot of money. And I would open the number of the Prime Minister. People had a lot of money. People believed that BPC has the number. Account number. But what did he say? He had a report of the report of the Vinod Rai. He had a lot of money. On that 2G scam. The court said there is no Gotala. So I am saying what you have said. People start, people are trying to make sure that they have been doing this for a long time, or they have been doing this for a long time, or they have been doing this for a long time. So people believe it or not. So the opposition's strategy is this. So politics is this, Anand Ranganathan, that will become a place. That basically is the gist of it, that will become a place, Dr. Ranganathan. With due respect to Agni Hotri, he's a very senior person. I have great respect for him. But please do not draw any equivalence with whatever Adani is doing and Beaufort, even though I am absolutely not batting for Adani. If he's corrupt, he should go to jail. And by the way, Padmaja Supreme Court has not really vindicated Adani at all, so he's not given clean shit as yet. Now, as far as Beaufort is concerned, uh, you would know Agni Hotri ji. There was irrefutable evidence brought out by Chitra Subramaniam that Quatrochi, through AE services, obtained kickbacks. Irrefutable evidence. So please do not draw any equivalence. That the government, both BJP and Congress, did not act is different. Is different that they no. You have you can either go by evidence. That's why are you are you going to say that A Raja was also innocent? There was no 2G scam because court acquitted him. Court can acquit. That's a different matter. But the fact of the matter is that so why ultimately. Mr. N. Ram has written a detailed report on Rafael. N. Ram has written a detailed report on Rafael. But we go by the Supreme Court verdict that there is no corruption. So ultimately we will go by the court. 